Hello Warriors, and today we're trying something a little different from our regular monthly subscription box of Game of Girl Monthly. I saw this advertised on Facebook, it was like, okay, get a free box, just pay the $6 shipping. And it's another subscription box, of course, and like, every month you get a free t-shirt and some other stuff, so it asks you your t-shirt size, which I... <laughs> Depending on where I go for t-shirts, my sizes range all over the place because I'm tall. So I can wear like a small t-shirt to fit me width-wise, but it does not fit me lengthwise. So I either have to go with a medium or a large t-shirt, depending on how they fit. Sometimes I can go with small if they're longer. So I think I went with a medium for this, but here is the fuel box. And on the sides it says hashtag fuel. But I like the cute little robot guy. So we're gonna pry this out. I think the fun part right now is gonna be figuring out how to open the box without destroying it. I should have figured out how to do that first. I mean, the Gamer Girl monthly boxes were really simple to open. I honestly have no idea how they want you to open this. I found tape. Tape's always a good sign, right? Ah, okay. So, oh, here we go. Box. Oh, I'm liking the signs of this already. I don't have anywhere to put this. My desk is a hot mess right now. Okay, so in the on the very top here, we have a Geek Fuel magazine with Mario from Super Mario Odyssey on it. I love that game. I need to finish it. Um, it says it's issue number 36. And... Oh, this is interesting here. We'll come back to that. We want to see what's in the box, right? We'll read the newsletter thing later. Okay. So, here... It's cold. I didn't realize that it was, like delivered the other day. What, today's the third? It was delivered on the first and I just forget to check the mail a lot. So this says Geek Fuel 2018 and this is shut. <laughs> so now we have to try and open this one again. Oh, I forget. It also said like you were going to get some sort of Mario related object. Or Nintendo related object, I'm sorry, this month. Um, I don't have scissors. Like, what kind of person am I? I don't have scissors in my apartment or around my desk area. So, here we go. This should work, right? this up. What is this? Oh, is it a lanyard? Okay, that's a really long lanyard. I don't know what this is actually supposed to be. Yeah, it's supposed to be a lanyard, I think. You just... Buttons. Snap buttons. It's a lanyard. And it says, it's upside down for you guys. It says, keep feel monthly mystery box and it has the little robot on it it's really thick for my liking but I get it I totally get it and it's cute I'll find something to hang it on I wish it actually like would have come together sewn as a lanyard and not buttoned I don't have room to put stuff on my desk so we're just kind of throwing, throwing it out there is this gonna, oh, okay, so also in the box with that is a Geek Fuel 2018 pin. One of those pins, it's not one of the pins I put on my board. I can try putting it up there. I don't know how, how well it'll work. And it's really nice because it came with like foam stuff in the box. Like, it's really nice boxing. I mean, it's not the cute little baggies that Gamer Girl Monthly gives you every month that I like to collect when I get a new one, but 
something. Okay, so next is a fuel box and it says fuel exclusive on the bottom. Okay, so this is the t-shirt. Oh, that's right. I remember them saying there was a Transformers item in here. Okay, so we have a Optimus Prime t-shirt. This, this was a good size choice for me. Optimus Prime. I like it. I don't know anything like this. I think I got a medium. Oh no, I've got, I got a women's large. Okay. So, it's not... If you're not, like, super skinny, I don't know, I would go with a men's size shirt. I feel like men's shirts are wider, just naturally, when you go up in size, because this is still really skinny for a large, and I don't, I think it went up to an extra large for women, and that was about it. Like, I don't know, I'll, I'll try it on, and I'll post it on my Instagram to help you see how it fits me because I don't know that large just doesn't seem like it's super wide for people who need it oh this is heavy this box was super heavy whenever I picked it up I'm like geez I was not expecting this okay this notebook video game premium notebook receive one of six entertaining designs oh so okay it's a notebook and a fancy Packaging. Okay. Put all your chicas in here and look at that. I ripped the box. How typical. Why do I always screw things up? Okay. Oh. That's so cute. It has a... It's 3D. So he like... He sticks out. It's cute. Let's see. I don't know, then it's up then now. And it has like the red brick pattern. I don't know if you can tell that on the video. Okay. Official Nintendo license. Premium A5 notebook. This is not coming off though, I'm just ripping it. Yeah, it's super cute because it sticks out. Can you see? Like, it sticks out. I don't know. I'll show you. And the Super Mario part sticks out too. And there's a nice little notch for you to put a pencil in there. Oh, it's so cute. Can you see it? It's like all the little, the ice flower, the green shell, the pow, and stuff like that. And then. It's just a bunch of white pages with the little mushrooms in the bottom. That is super cute. I feel like this is something that I think is so cute that I'm not going to use. That I'm going to hate myself. And I dropped a box. Hopefully, they okay. Okay. It's over here. Oh! Okay, this is cool. So, it's a Steam card for a game, The Marvelous Mistake, and it's a downloadable Steam ca Steam game card for a $20 value, but of course you have to get this game, which, I mean, try it out. I'll, I'll make a video of that for them since they're doing this. Um, it says, in the bustling heart of London, a once magnificent Art collection has been unscrupulously poached and split up among private collectors. Meet Sophia Take, the rightful heir to the misappropriated masterpieces. Help Sophia to reclaim her inheritance on an exciting and daring adventure across the capital. So that's cool. For $6, I got a free $20 game, t shirt, a bunch of other cool stuff so far. So. This here. Okay. So I think that was it for this box. Okay, so this says 
Prime, Geek Fuel exclusive shirt, stumped on what to wear in the morning, roll out of bed and reach for this shirt. We can't resist the design with an awesome retro 80s vibe. So this month we pay homage to our favorite heroic leader of Sentinel robot beings. And then on the back, you've got the 2018 exclusive member pin and the lanyard set. And then it shows the different notebooks you could have gotten, so that was the included Nintendo item. You could have gotten the Super Mario one like I did. There's a Peach one, two different Legend- oh no, three different Legend of Zelda ones, so that's the five. There's the- a blue Legend of Zelda one with the shield, a green one with the Triforce bird symbol thing, and just a brown notebook with- I mean, they have like the- I don't know how you want to describe them. The things that you pull to close it in the front and it has the Triforce symbol on it. And then of course it says it comes with the same game. Be on the lookout for the Pin Pals collectible series coming next month featuring exclusive official licensed designs of your favorite pop culture film and television characters. This is interesting. I don't know if I'll do this again. Like I said, I got it. I don't know, I actually know if I said it. I got it on Facebook. And it was an advertisement. And I was like, yeah, just pay shipping and we'll send you your first month of Geek Fuel. And I was like, okay, we'll try it out. $6 shipping isn't the worst. So I decided to try that. I mean, all these things are pretty cool. Let's see if you can use the hashtag. Um, what is this? Oh, it's here. There's a thing about the Steam game that it gave you. Ultimate Geek Gift Guide. Just a bunch of geeky things they recommend for giving as gifts. Okay. I see. And then, you know. It says like, oh, these are like the big games coming out soon or coming out right now for each console. So like Monster Hunter World for PlayStation 4, Dragon Ball Fighter Z, and Lost Fear for Nintendo Switch. Geeky Resolutions. And Best of Nintendo 2017. So yeah, all in all, I think this was pretty good. I don't know, I mean, obviously it's not like Gamer Girl Monthly where I picked what I wanted, they send me the monthly, here's what you get type of thing. So I don't know if I'll do that again, or maybe I'll just do it once in a while because sometimes there will be things that it's like, I don't want that. And that's why I liked Gamer Girl Monthly, is because I could pick and choose what video games I wanted stuff from, so I wasn't getting stuff I didn't like or didn't necessarily want, but I also don't wear jewelry a lot, so I mean, as much as I like them and I say I'm gonna wear them, I end up not wearing them 90% of the time because I just forget. <laughs> so, I don't know, I might take a break for a little bit from getting subscription boxes because, I don't know. I just want to find one that's going to work out well for me, and one that I'm going to like everything I get, which probably won't happen. It's like, can you do something like Gamer Girl Monthly where I pick the things I want and have, like, more choices and stuff like that? But then I also want, like, TV shows and things other than jewelry. Or not necessarily TV shows, like Marvel and stuff like that. Someone get on it! I will totally support you in this business. I'll come in as a partner, but, um, yeah. So I'm, it's official. I am canceling my Gamer Girl Monthly subscription, and I don't know about this. So I'll see what they're offering for next month, but I'm going to cancel that for now, too, because you have to sign up for the subscription, but, like, I'll just cancel it as soon as I get this one. But, I will let you guys know then. Obviously, if you see me post another video, we'll see how it goes. But until then, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one, Warriors.